always ask about my clients when they're hiring. They want to know what their case is worth. And as I tell them, I can't answer that question, especially early on in a case, because every injury is different. Every person is different. And there's not a litmus test that says, hey, I broke an arm, that's worth X dollars. I had $5,000 in medical bills, that's worth X dollars. We need to take a look at all the injuries and damages to my client and get to understand how those injuries affected them in their life in order to make a proper assessment as to what their case is worth. A back injury to a, an attorney is probably worth less than a back injury to a laborer who can no longer go to work because of his back injury. Or an injury to a hand is probably worth a lot more money to a skilled surgeon than it is to a laborer who can continue to work. So each one of these things are unique. Now generally, what are the damages that we recover in a case? We recover your economic losses. Economic losses are those losses from your medical bills or your uh, out-of-pocket expenses, your wage losses, those are your economic losses. In addition to that, you receive non-economic, or what we call general damages. Those damages are for pain and suffering, the change in your quality of life, the humiliation of having to go through, you know, painful procedures or, you know, um, uh, uncomfortable events, for the change in your um, lifestyle, the ability to do the things you love to do. Um, those are our general damages, and, and as I talked about, those general damages, you know, you, there's not an exact dollar amount that you can put on those. And those general damages are what are unique to every one of our clients. And the role of a good personal injury attorney is to understand how their clients' injuries affected them.